Hi guys, today we are getting our clean and our decorated on because today we are doing a Christmas clean and decorate with me video. And I think this may be my favorite clean and decorate video with me ever because it is a clean and decorate with me for Christmas of my master bedroom. I have never decorated my bedroom as much as this for Christmas. And this year I finally have the opportunity to do so. So let's get straight to it. we are starting off by tidying everything up as you can see there is a big mess in here we need to change bed sheets we need to get things tidied away there are lots of deliveries that we need to do and we've also been hit by covid as well during this so we also need to kind of get rid of all of the cold and flu stuff and get all of these work surfaces clear and ready to clean so I'm going to start off by opening up the blinds, opening up the windows and letting some fresh air in and then changing out bed sheets and getting the bed strip to go in the wash. Okay, so to get us started, we have some new Christmas bed in. Oh my goodness, when I saw this Christmas bed in, I was like slightly in love with it. So I have wanted some new neutral Christmas bed in forever, but my husband has loved this stuff, this bedding that I've had for years and years and years. He loves the feel of it, the texture of it, and all things like that. But it's like a really soft, I don't know how to describe it. And whilst I don't mind the look of it, I kind of wanted to upgrade us this year. So I went searching online and I found this bedding and oh my goodness, I mean, look at it. It is just to die for. I am obsessed and you can pretty much take this as a little bit of a hint as to how our bedroom is gonna look come the end of this video. So this is the bedding. It's got this gorgeous snowflake print on it. But they also had this bedding with like trees on it as well. But I'm in love. I picked it up in a king size. They do it in all different sizes. I think they do it on so many different retailers' websites as well. So I'll leave everything in the description box below for you. But I'm going to go pop this in the wash. So I'm trying to be super organized this year with all of my Christmas shopping, but in turn, I just have stacks and stacks of boxes and parcels and all sorts lying around. But have you guys started your Christmas shopping yet? I would love to know if you're almost done, if you've not even started, where are you at? Because I just feel the need to be organized this year. And I can't believe how messy this room has actually gotten whilst I have been slobbing away in bed quite uncomfortably um yeah I would much rather have been downstairs on the sofa with the boys but that is all going to change because once this bedroom has had its makeover I feel like I can slob in here forever more
one of the things that really helps my sleep at the moment is by having my Neon Diffuser on and this scent is insane. It is my favourite scent to have on of a night. It makes the room smell so fresh but so calming. I am just obsessed with it. So if you're looking for a diffuser oil scent, highly recommend this. But I'm so glad all the windows are open. I'm airing it all out. Literally, these windows were open and closed the whole way through this video because where we live, it's really super windy and the blinds, everything was just kind of blowing backwards and forwards. The sun was in and out. It was a nightmare. I also need to pop some stands on this TV. We moved in six months ago and we still don't have stands on this TV. A little bit insane, but I'm finally getting around to, you know, kind of doing the tasks that need to be done to make our bedroom nice because our bedroom is the last bedroom to be worked on in this house. Everyone else has like a semi nice bedroom with lights and bedding and all their rooms have been done up. And me and Adam have just put ourselves to the bottom of the priority list. So I felt like it was about time we deserve to make our bedroom a nice, calming, relaxing space again. So now I'm moving on to a task which I've been meaning to do for a while and that's cleaning this little area over here by the wardrobe door on the carpet. Unfortunately my powder and my blush are cracked when we went away and when I came back it was kind of all dispersed in my makeup bag and obviously it's still got loads in it but it's got odd cracked bits and they just keep falling out everywhere and in turn they kind of trickle over the carpet. So a little bit of Dr Beckman and I've cleaned it all off in a jiffy. It's all gone, the carpet is looking as good as new. But I'd love to know if you have any recommendations for any other good carpet cleaners or anything like that. And now we are getting to the good bit. This is probably one of the most exciting parts of this makeover because it is time for us to get a new mattress. The old mattress is going. It was really beginning to make me have really bad backache and have loads of problems sleeping. I was really starting to feel Adam in the middle of the night when he rolled over. And I found when I was waking up in the morning, I was rolling in the middle and my back was really sore. So we are working with Emma on this. They have kindly sent me one of their mattresses to try out. And I cannot tell you how excited I am for this mattress. Now, I have tried and tested this mattress before actually sharing any of this because I did want to review it myself. So I'm getting the mattress out of the box here. They actually have a QR code on the top of the box, which you can scan, which helps you with the setup. But it's really easy. It was a case of literally getting it out of the box, popping it on the bed, waiting for it, undoing it all, and then waiting for it to kind of like pop up and inflate, and then giving it about five hours for it to take its full shape. So I did this in the morning, so I had plenty of time, so it would be ready for me to get into that evening. And besides, I had decorating that I needed to do, <laughs> so there was more important things. So Emma actually have a range of different mattresses, but this mattress in particular is the Lux Cooling Mattress. Now, the reason why this mattress in particular appealed for me and Adam to get this is for a variety of reasons. First reason being, as many of you guys know, I suffer quite badly with really bad back pain and really, really struggle with that throughout the last God knows how many years now. So for me, having a mattress that can support me well 
is of crucial importance. Now with me and Adam basically being little and large, I really struggle with the fact that when the mattress isn't supported well, I can find myself rolling into him, I'm not supported and I wake up with really, really bad back pain. So this mattress in particular has five layers of support. It has an optimal spinal alignment, which is used through the pocket springs within the mattress. Now these support the head, shoulder, your lumbar, pelvic, and your lower legs. So this is really, really great for me. Now, not only this, but it also has the technology in it, which essentially isolates motion. So what I mean by this is Adam rolls over in his sleep all the time. And essentially when he then moves, he really disturbs my sleep. So in having this technology, it enables me to not essentially go rolling and releases the pressure in the mattress. So I essentially am not disturbed by him moving around in the night. So I've actually included here a clip of the mattress five hours later, once it was all fluffed up and oh my God, the softness level is just out of this world. It is so soft, yet when you lay on it, you can really feel how firm it is. And I'm actually sharing this after having slept on this now for quite a few nights as I wanted to test it out before giving you any information about how our sleep has gone. But before I do that, I wanna share with you one last thing that I love about this mattress. So I don't know about you, but me and my husband are polar opposites when we go to bed of a night. So I'm always really cold and he is like, a walking radiator. He is always really, really hot. So it's really, really hard for us to kind of balance that when you're sharing a bed. So something that I really, really loved about this particular mattress was the fact that it actually had revolutionary graphite infused cooling foam layers, which are built into the mattress and they absorb excess body heat and then distribute it away from the mattress. Now this helps your body achieve the optimal temperature to get you into a deeper night's sleep. And really helps reduce any moisture buildup, reduce that damp feeling, the sweating and things like that. So the temperature regulation was really, really important to us so we can really have a deeper night's sleep. And it's proven that by regulating your body temperature, you do get into that deeper phase of sleep. So again, another huge benefit to this mattress that we really, really loved. Now, one of the key things for me when buying a mattress is the fact that they are so expensive and they are an investment purchase. They're not something that you just pick up cheaply. And if you do, I always say buy cheap, buy twice, especially when it comes to your sleep. But they're such a big investment purchase, but everyone's sleep is slightly different. And I was really worried that getting a new mattress, if I didn't like it, and it ended up somehow being worse than one that I was already sleeping on, I was gonna really regret it. So Emma actually offer a 200 night risk-free trial, which essentially means you can try this mattress out for 200 nights and if your body still doesn't agree with it and you still don't like it, then you can return it. They say it takes roughly six to eight weeks for your body to adjust to a new mattress. I'm gonna tell you now, it didn't take no adjusting for me. I had the best night's sleep that I have had in forever on that mattress in the first night and have proceeded to have a good night's sleep. And my husband was a little bit worried that it was gonna be a little bit too firm for him. And he is also over the moon with the new mattress. He said it supported him really well. And all the things that I mentioned about the temperature technology, all things like that, he didn't really have many of those issues, which is great. But on top of this, Emma also offer a 10 year guarantee as well, which is amazing. So if you have any issues with your mattress, you can obviously call them up and speak to them regarding the guarantee. So you know that your kind of purchase, your investment is covered and you're safe. Now, we was also really lucky that we had a couple of other goodies sent to us as well, including a mattress topper. And we also had this duvet and we were in desperate need for a new duvet in itself. And this one in particular has two layers. So this one has a spring autumn duvet and then it also has a summer one. But the good thing about this is you can pop them together. And when you pop them together, it makes your thicker winter duvet. Now, again, going back to that whole regulating temperature thing, Myself and Adam find that we normally end up just sleeping with a sheet, which isn't normally heavy enough for us. And that's what we end up using in the summer. So this is perfect for not having to buy a whole new duvet, but just being able to split up the duvets that we already have. 
So Emma also had these weighted blankets as well. Now I have never used a weighted blanket before, but as you can see here, when I opened it up, I instantly fell in love. So essentially, like I just mentioned, it's a weighted blanket, but it's really meant to help you sleep and help relieve like stress. Now, as someone that really, really struggles with sleep, this is gonna be absolutely heaven. And I mean, look at the bounce on that. <laughs> These pillows were so, so comfortable to sleep on. They really, really were. So whilst I start showing you all of the bits that I am now about to decorate with, I wanted to share with you that Emma have actually got a huge Black Friday sale on at the moment where you can get up to 65% off. And they've actually given me an exclusive discount code. So if you use this discount code, which I will leave on the screen for you, you will get a further discount. So do go and check it out if you're looking for a new mattress or any other pieces for your bedroom. They do so many different things from bed frames, to duvets, pillows, and so much more. Now is the time to utilize this with them having 65% off and offering you guys an additional discount with this code. You know, you'd be mad not to. I will leave everything linked in the description box below for you to go and have a look yourself. Okay, so next up I wanna show you the tree that we got. Now, I got it from George from their Christmas range and stupidly they covered the main big picture with the label, which I can't get off. But I picked up the five foot pop-up snowy tree. It's pre-lit, which is exactly what I'm after because I'm so done with having to light trees. <laughs> Um, it's pre-lit and it's one of these snowy ones, which I think is going to look amazing. Maybe I'm going to regret putting a snowy one in my bedroom. But a lot of people don't really come in here, especially over in that corner, bar me and Adam. And I'm pretty much the only person that walks past it. So I'm hoping we'll be all right. So that's going to go up over here. Ooh. But I also picked up a new tree skirt from Dunelm. I'm obsessed with this, 10 pounds. Check out my recent haul if you wanna see more, but I am obsessed with this. Look how good it looks. So this is gonna go around it. Now I also didn't realize I picked up a five foot tree. So I may also need to pop like a box under the tree or something just to give it a bit more height. Um, but we'll see. Yes, I am on my way. We'll put our differences aside and just enjoy this moment of peace and love and happiness. We come together to celebrate. Yes, every time the snow is falling down and it is cold outside, we gather around the fireplace and no one cares about yesterday. Okay, so the tree wasn't quite what I was expecting. It didn't really go up on the box. It was like a pop-up tree and I'm not quite sure what I think of it. It's quite little. I'm not quite happy with like, I've fluffed it up as much as I can, but it kind of came on like these like cotton elasticy type string things and just went over a tube. I mean, it's all very, very odd, but you'll have to let me know what you think of the tree. It wasn't very expensive, but I don't think I'm overly happy with it. So let me know what you guys think of it below and if you have any good tree recommendations because I'm actually on the hunt for a new tree for our main living area as well. But now I'm going around and I'm doing all of my cushions. Now I don't know why I haven't thought of this before but I just bought new cushion covers for the season and in my head normally I've always had it that I need to buy new cushions but I'm being really silly because I just need to buy new cushion covers for the cushions that I already have. So I don't know why I've never thought of this, like never, not in years and years. Um, but now I'm putting all of the new cushion covers for Christmas on my cushions and making them look very, very festive.
Yes, every time the snow is falling down and it is cold outside, we gather around the fireplace and no one cares about yesterday. So it's a little bit later on in the day here and we had done a few other bits. So we'd actually put up our light fix in. I cannot tell you how much hard work this was. Um, it was so hard. We had to basically put it all together ourselves, which I wasn't anticipating. I was expecting it to be built when I got it out of the box. I also had to wait for the bed in to dry and I had to go and grab some tree decorations that I knew that I had out of the garage as well. So there was a lot to it. Look how big and fluffy those pillows are, by the way completely my vibe and I also love how nicely the duvet went into the sheet my old duvet was like really like droopy and it lost a lot of life out of it and it never really filled the duvet sheets anymore so I'm so excited for this but yeah we basically essentially had a lot to do so it was quite late by the time that I got round to filming this part of the video but I was determined that I was going to bed relaxing in my bedroom and that it was going to be like my sanctuary by the time I went to sleep. So I've just about finished putting out all the decorations. I'm now about to decorate the tree and I'm not quite sure what I was doing here. I was trying to fill some gaps in this tree because like I said, it wasn't really giving me the vibe that I wanted. So please let me know your final thoughts on the tree and if you think I should upgrade the size, if I should change it up, like what do you think? I don't think I was overly happy with it. But nevertheless, I mean, I've got a tree in my bedroom this year. So other than that, you know, I've got to be happy. But these are the finished results. I do think the bedroom felt so relaxing, so calming. I loved all the colours through it. I mean, look how comfortable that bed looks. If that is not the bed of dreams, then I don't know what it is. But I could not wait 
to get into bed that evening. And when I'm telling you I had the best night's sleep in that bedroom, when it was clean, it was calm, it was relaxing, and then it was also comfortable. I mean, all of the C's there, but it just gave me everything that I needed from a bedroom. But you will have to let me know if you've enjoyed this video, if you've enjoyed getting inspired to clean and decorate alongside me. Don't forget that Emma, like I mentioned, have that exclusive discount code for you to utilize on their website on top of the sale that they already have. Like I mentioned, I will leave everything linked in the description box below for you so you can go and check it out yourself. But in the meantime, I will see you all for another video very, very soon, guys. I hope you've enjoyed it. Bye.